John Liz just spoke to the media right behind me in the media workroom for 20 minutes. First question he gets from Matt Mayoko, hey, Jed York was in here yesterday and he told us that you guys knew Brock Purdy was the best quarterback on the team week one of training camp his rookie year. Is that true? And you know, John Lynch, so diplomatic. Oh, shucks, absolutely. Yeah, I remember that conversation. It was something else, my jaw hit the floor. But you know, I'm really not here to look back. I'm here to look forward, which is quite an interesting way to start the interview. He also said, oh, hey, Jed was spitting fire yesterday, wasn't he? With a kind of a nervous laugh. So my interpretation was John Lynch came into this media room, if not primarily, yeah, primarily, to change the whole narrative from what Jed York said yesterday. Because what Jed York did yesterday was go in there and reminisce, tell stories, you know, sort of patting himself on the back. Oh man, we knew Brock was gonna be great back then. Ah, Kyle didn't even want Christian McCaffrey, but here's the story about how we got him. I was integral in that. It's like, you know what, man? That's a great story that you can tell 20 years down the line when you guys have your Lombardi trophies. You don't tell it before the game. You know why? Because you're taking focus off the game. You're the owner of the team. You set the tone. You walk in here and you talk about the past, tell stories. No, no, no. John Lynch needed to get out of his office, come down here, and set the focus for the team. We're focused on the Super Bowl. We're focused on the next game. Not the past. Not stories. The next game. And you know why that's significant? Because of all the people in this organization... John's the champion, not Jed, not Kyle. They could be soon, but John is really the only one. John and Traverius Ward. John's the only one who knows what it takes to be a champion. Jed York said something yesterday like champions act like champions before, before they're champions. Yeah, well, Jed didn't act like a champion yesterday because he stopped and smelled the roses, right? He's like a mile away from the summit of Everest and he stops and looks around and says, I made it. I just want to thank people. Man, he's like the, the villain in a James Bond movie who's right when he's got James Bond starts doing a soliloquy. Man, there's so many people I want to thank at this moment. That was Jed yesterday. John Lynch, the champion, comes in here, Captain freaking America, and says, we're focused on the next game. Gotta love John Lynch.